the Iceman Chuck Liddell against Vernon Tiger White. California from the Lions Den, very experienced Vernon Tiger White. Vernon Tiger White, star pupil of the Lions Den, very consistent, solid mixed martial arts fighter who's got good skills in all areas. Very good on the ground, very good striker, excellent experience, good composure. And again, he comes to the Lions Den, so like you said in the in the pre-fight interview. I mean, he's been hit by Ken Shamrock, and he's not worried about getting hit by Chuck Liddell. I don't know if that's such a good comparison, but we'll find out once two get in the ring. See Ken Shamrock giving him some last-minute advice and a pep talk. Vernon Tiger White, along with Guy Metzger, is, uh, they're the two most solid pupils that Ken Shamrock ever put out. Vernon's a very solid fighter. And there was a time, Joe, when the Lions' den was on the top of the food chain, and then they were dethroned by Militich, they were dethroned by Team Quest, even Team Punishment. With Ken success last UFC, if Vernon can do something here, and then Guy Mesker in the next show against Tito, the Lions' den becomes prominent again. Absolutely, and Vernon Tiger White believes that he can put the Lions' den back on the map with a big win tonight over Chuck Liddell. And uh, certainly he'll put Vernon White on the map. I mean, that would be a tremendous upset, but it's not outside the realm of possibility. Very veteran, very skilled in this fight game since its inception, Vernon Tiger White. Oh, boy. Joe, as your good friend Eddie Bravo says, this man's blowing up. This man is blowing up in popularity, and all it took was a couple of fast hands on Tito Ortiz. A couple of fast hands and Juliette Lewis screaming your name in the audience. I want Chuck Liddell! I want Chuck Liddell! <laughs> Chuck Liddell, very, very, very tough guy to face in the octagon. World-class wrestler, world-class striker, world-class mixed martial arts competitor with a wealth of experience. Knockout power in both hands and his feet. And very difficult to take down. If he wants to stand up, it's gonna be very hard for Vernon Tiger White to take him down. Chuck is a Division I wrestler, competed in wrestling at a national level and did excellent. And he's a, a very accomplished kickboxer. The knock on Chuck in the past was that some fights he did not train as hard for as others. And the best motivation for Chuck was when Dana White and Joe Silva said, how about fighting Vernon Tiger White? He said, absolutely, that's awesome, that's perfect. It's not a motivation he needs for the fight, but there is motivation needed for the many, many hours and long hours of training. Absolutely, it's, it's not the will to fight that's difficult to find, it's the will to prepare to fight. And when you really, truly hate a guy, and you just can't imagine losing to him, it makes it so much easier when that alarm clock goes off and you gotta run. They are on their feet here at the sold-out MGM Grand Garden Arena. Chuck, the Iceman Liddell, set to enter the octagon. Kind of amazing at one point in time, that man was in Tito Ortiz's shadow, and he has so clearly eclipsed him at this point. I mean, that one knockout loss to Tito has kind of shut him out in the fans' eyes. People see him now and they boo. It's, it's, it's truly amazing what a transference has occurred. The, the, the Tito that we saw just a few years ago. Chuck Liddell is the star now under Randy Couture and Peter Belfer. The victims of the Chuck Liddell run to the top are pretty legendary. From Randleman to Bustamante, Sulu F. Belfort, Babalu, and recently Tito Ortiz. He's fought the best. He's defeated most of them. He is the number one contender for the light heavyweight championship, the Iceman Chuck Liddell.
tail of the tape for this light heavyweight battle brought to you by Cobb 28. Gear for the extreme found at Cobb28.com. Chuck the Iceman Liddell is two years older than Vernon Tiger White. It's all been talked about. It is time to get down to business. Our tail of the tape. For the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, the warrior standing to my left. This man is a submission fighting expert. He holds a mixed martial arts record of 11 wins with eight losses and one draw. Standing six feet, one inch tall, he weighed in at 200 pounds. Fighting out of San Diego, California, please welcome Vernon Tiger White! And now, introducing his opponent standing across the octagon, this UFC warrior is a kickboxer. He holds a professional mixed martial arts record of 13 wins with three losses. He stands six feet two inches tall and weighed in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of San Luis Obispo, California, please welcome the Iceman, Chuck When the action begins, our referee in charge is Mario Yamasaki. Okay, I already gave some instructions to you on the locker room. I just want you guys to do a clean fight. Okay, obey my, follow my orders at all times. You guys have any questions? Good luck. How much does this crowd love Chuck Liddell? Wow. Want to be a fan favorite? Knock out Tito Ortiz. I, didn't, I don't think I heard one clap for Vernon. The Iceman, Chuck Liddell. The Tiger, Vernon White. The talk is over. Very personal, both men can strike. Oh, Liddell tries that big right. He loves coming over the top. Oh, and Vernon answers Straight the right, right with Vernon. Arm. Oh, this oh, is a slugfest early. Chuck trying to tee up. Chuck caught him, and oh. he slips. And now gets the takedown. That was a slip by Liddell, but he was able to gather himself and take down Vernon White. Vernon's got a butterfly guard. He's got Chuck's right arm tied up. Chuck's loose. He says, come on up, big boy. Ooh, nice left hook by Chuck. Wow, Chuck's confidence just continues to grow. You can see it in the way he's attacking here early. Good kick. Oh, oh nice that right, right connected hand. on the top of the head. Now a swinging left. One thing we do know about Chuck, he has an excellent chin, excellent ability to take a shot. Vernon White likes to loop in a little bit too, doesn't he, Joe? Absolutely, these guys are throwing bombs. Toe to toe we go. Oh, big right, right hand. Right hand. Down goes White. Liddell with the action pressing it. And White regains his composure. That's what but you see only the momentarily. Look at Chuck Liddell. Wow. Vernon White's doing a good job of avoiding the real big blows. Yeah, he is. Trying He's to spin out. He his back, his back. Look out for the kick. Oh, oh and big right hand. Vernon White is basically out in his finish him. Wow, what a barrage. Vernon White showing excellent composure. And, and a big now right hand of his There's another right. Oh. And down he goes again. He's Yamasaki right on top of the action. Wow, what a warrior Vernon White is. He can't just stand there and let this guy punch him. Yamasaki will stop it. He's got to get up. Now Chuck could kick him in the body or the legs in that position, but not the head. Vernon Chuck White just, just hanging him back tough. up on his feet. Wow, what a touch by Vernon White. Wow, amazing recuperative ability. These are the toughest men in the world, ladies and gentlemen. Vernon White showing a lot of heart. Are you kidding me right now, Joe? Those aren't boxing gloves. Exactly. Little baby four-ounce gloves that do nothing but protect the knuckles from being broken. Nice body kick and then left hand. Wow. Vernon Tiger White, is not, his, his claws are still out. It's very early, but 
I bet Chuck a is taking some the, deep breaths. Yeah, a little bit in the mind of Chuck. He feels like this baby should have already been over. Absolutely, he's got to be a little nut. No, he, nice leg kick by Vernon White. And that can get frustrating. Oh. Down he goes again. That might have been more of a slip, but Liddell comes right in on the opening and continues to throw with a flurry. White protecting himself again, at least for now. Mario Yamasaki doing a very good job of letting these guys fight in this bad position. Vernon Tiger White is covering up. He's taking some shots, but he's okay. So you want to be an ultimate fighter. One minute, 40 seconds remains in round one. None of these shots are doing any damage. Those elbows look pretty good. Listen to Chuck Liddell work it. He's very arm weary though, if you notice by those punches. Nice right Upper hand cut. there. Oh, Vernon Tiger White tries the spinning back kick. There is no one sitting down here at the sold out MGM Grand Garden Arena. Not one fan. Oh, big left hand! Is on, Vernon, on their feet. He rocked Chuck Liddell with that left hand. Vernon Tiger White has got incredible heart. He, Chuck turned to look to his corner for advice there. Oh, oh kick right here. That's time. it. Down he wow. goes. Chuck Liddell.